Well, Higgins his rally got off to an unhappy start, but his minimum aim here must be the P3 that he's in at the moment behind the two factory Mitsubishi. Anything more means he's got a reel in Evans and he's already six seconds in front. Yeah, but he's going to be pushing hard. Higgy has to keep the pressure on. Try and keep it neat and tidy, don't lose any time on these junctions. And it is difficult to get the braking areas 100% accurate because you're at such high speeds and then you're coming down to 30 miles an hour for the tight square corners. Windaf Evans. Second place, six seconds ahead of Higgins, which he'll be thinking about. Six seconds behind Wilkes, he'll be thinking about that too, won't he? Yeah. Gwindar's been really fast all year, but he's been troubled with transmission issues in the Mitsubishi. And David Higgins already on the pace, not too far away. If he didn't have that overshoot in the first stage, he would have been bang there with them. Well, six at the end of uh, stage one after that overshoot, but he's now only three seconds behind Philip Morrow. Yeah, lots of really narrow link sections, all grassy and slippery. Philip's main ambition this weekend is to win that Evolution Challenge title. But he's dropped off this short leaderboard now as David Higgins picks up the pace. Guy Wilkes increases his lead over his teammate Gwyneth Evans and his championship rival Mark Higgins. No rest and no service. They're straight into stage three. This is Gail Rigg. It's seven miles long. Wilkes blasts the Mitsubishi off the line. 11 seconds up in Gwyneth now and 18 seconds advantage over Mark Higgins. Looks to have this event under control straight away. Fast out the box, and he's shown that in every event this year. Thanks, guy. That's a bill we'll send you. Mark Higgins, all he can do now is keep the pressure on, but he's third, he's 18 seconds behind Wilkes, and he's seven seconds down on Gwyneth Evans. Three, two, one, go. David Higgins firing his impress off the line. David, well suited to these Group N cars, has won the British Rally Championship title in Group N on three occasions. These roads hard as tarmac, but slippery as we've been hearing some sections of the rally are. Tarmac, Robbie, what on earth is that? That isn't good news. What? That's... It's a fort lift going the wrong direction down the stage. The marshal trying to stop him, and David Higgins is approaching this, coming up the other way, the correct way, and the diggers coming down. 120 miles an hour, David Higgins. He can't know about this, and the man's lowering the bucket. He, this is could be a disaster if somebody doesn't stop him. If there aren't enough marshals there, if there are no spectators, David Higgins is going to get the surprise and shock of his life. Whoa! Just narrowly avoids that guy five meters more, and that could have been a disaster. And he's Whoa. waving at the marshals as he well might. Well. David Higgins, reactions or what? Absolutely unbelievable. Who is this idiot? And there it is from the other angle. David Higgins narrowly avoids that machine, but how the heck did he get on there? That guy needs locked up. Well, on board again, here's the replay. Lucky he's on this side of the car. And lucky it was a right-hander and he was sliding slightly wide. The 